thyroid hormone tests. Determination of optimal TSH ranges for reflex-free T4 testing. CTFP Volume 11 Issue 2 Background TSH measurement is generally regarded as the most sensitive initial laboratory test for screening individuals for thyroid hormone abnormalities. This is due to the fact that small changes in free T4 levels result in larger changes in TSH values. Many clinicians and laboratories check TSH alone as the initial test for thyroid problems and then only add a free T4 measurement if the TSH is abnormal, outside the laboratory normal reference range. When the laboratory adds the free T4 test to the blood sample automatically based on an abnormal TSH result, it referred to as reflex testing. Although laboratories vary, most report a normal TSH reference range between 0.40.5 mu L on the lower end and 45.5 mu L on the upper end of the range. The goal of this study was to evaluate different TSH cutoffs leading to reflex-free T4 testing, with the purpose to determine whether a widened normal range could decrease the need for additional free T4 testing and not lead to missing cases of thyroid problems. The full article title. Pinzem et al. Rationalizing Thyroid Function Testing, Which TSH Cutoffs Are Optimal for Testing Free T4. Jacqueline Ando Grinal. Matab. 2017. 102. 11. 4235 4241. Summary of the study. These investigators evaluated TSH and free T4 measurements in two populations. One group of 120,403 individuals, named the clinical group, had thyroid tests performed in a single laboratory in Western Australia over a 12-year period of time. This group was compared to community group of 4,568 individuals participating in the Bus Elton Health Study. All individuals had both TSH and free T4 measured. They excluded people with known pituitary disease, thyroid disease and other factors known to affect thyroid function tests. These investigators quantified the number of individuals at different TSH values that had high, low or normal free T4 levels. They measured the effect of changing the TSH reference range cutoffs on the number of reflex-free T4 tests. They determined how many times an abnormally high or low free T4 would have gone undetected if the TSH cutoffs for reflex testing had been changed. The normal reference range for the TSH was 0.44 mu L in this study. They found in the clinical group that if the TSH normal range that led to reflex free T4 testing was changed to from 0.44 mu L to 0.35 mu L, this would have led to a 22% reduction in the number of free T4 tests performed. As expected, if the TSH normal reference range was widened even more to 0.26 mu, L, even fewer reflex free T4 tests would have been done.